Matt, you're from ADB Robotics, but my first question is, what is automation and also machine tending? Automation and machine tending uh, is ultimately about making uh, processes uh, more efficient. Uh, people often think about labour saving as one of the key um, things when they, they look at um, uh, introducing robotics, but in actual fact, most of our customers uh, see an increase in productivity as the key driver to a cost saving. Okay, and now here, this is a flex load system, is that right? It is, yes. This is uh, one of a range of uh, products within the flex uh, load uh, range. Uh, this is a, a smaller to medium sized system, all on one base plate. The common uh, feature of this system is the flex loader vision, um, which it's all about making robotics easier, more accessible, and, uh, and ultimately more flexible. Okay. I don't want to go into loads of specifications, but this is part of a range. But very quickly, in terms of what size components will it handle? It'll handle from anything from small, tiny components to large components, and all the different uh, range of products are all uh, available for more detail on the MTD website if, if people want to have a, have a look. Yeah, nice and easy, not too technical there. So sm really small to really big components. Get in contact with you guys for this system. But you mentioned the vision system as well. Yeah, the, the heart of this system is uh, about flexibility. Uh, we have a, a lot of customers now that don't want just uh, one product and lots and lots of it. They want lots of different variants of that uh, of, a, of a product, uh, and they need to be able to be flexible enough to be able to do all those different uh, different products through the same system. And this system will handle all of that. With some customers programming a new product in every single day, uh, and that's the the beauty and ease of, of, of this system. Okay, and looking on here, the components themselves are fairly irregular in shape, but this is able to handle that, no problems at all. Absolutely, yeah. All different types and shapes of sizes of, of parts. Um, that, the system can be taught to recognize that very easily in about five minutes. Okay, so I think there's three key points here. So it's productivity, ease yep. of use, and flexibility. So in terms of the productivity, what, just give me a quick overview of that. Uh, productivity uh, wise, I mean, generally speaking, a manual system is between 25 to 40% less efficient than, a, than an automated uh, system. Uh, and we've got some fantastic examples uh, and case studies where people have, have, have employed uh, these systems and their productivity has literally gone through the roof. So ease of use, so? Ease of use. Um, ease of use, uh, we have many customers that have uh, 600, 400, even 150 different um, types and variants of components, all of which they've programmed themselves uh, without having to go through complex uh, traditional robot programming. Everything is done through the, uh, uh, through the Windows-based uh, system. Okay. So very, very simple to use. So if I, I mean, you might think automation, I need to be doing big batch runs running 24-7. That's not the case then? It isn't the case at all. Um, with, with this system, um, you can load a, uh, various different parts on a belt, um, you can run a small batch, then immediately switch over to a, to a different, uh, different batch. We can even load multiple batches um, on, on the same conveyor, uh, and we can, we can handle all of those and load it into, into the machine. And as we mentioned before, five minute uh, to, to program, um, it takes less time than it takes to set up the CNC machine. Oh, that, that's great. So essentially you've got your productivity, your easy use, your flexibility. Now, that's great, but you were mentioning about a case study. Castings yes. PLC, is that right? Absolutely, yeah. Um, fantastic case study uh, for us. Uh, a company uh, that are loading, uh, well, were manually loading CNC grinding machines. And um, they, they came to one of our open uh, events uh, and saw the, um, the flex loader systems and thought, hang on, this might be something that, that we might be interested in. They, we put a trial system in, in for them. Um, initially, again, uh, as I mentioned before, they, they were looking for labor savings, uh, health and safety improvements, uh, and they saw this as a way, a way of doing it. An added bonus was, was the productivity increase that, that they gained, uh, and they saw 60% increase in, in, in productivity um, purely from, from introducing uh, uh, this system uh, into, their, into their factory. That's an amazing saving, and also there, the health and safety rears its head again, so that's another point. Um, but people might think, well, you know, is it for me? Uh, you know, I'm not really sure, but what can you do to get over that? Uh, well, we're, we're doing at the moment uh, a survey where we can go out and, and come in, uh, into your factory, we can have a look at the different processes. Quite often, um, the, the processes that are worth automating are maybe not the ones that you're thinking about, uh, and, it, and it opens up quite a lot of, uh, a lot of doors. Uh, so we can have a look, we've got various different calculation tools, so we can help you work through and work out what are the right projects, what are the ones that are going to give you a return on investment. Um, 
and in certain applications where where we've got um, a, a good example and, and um, we can uh, take the machine, it's very, very portable, we can put it into your, um, your facility uh, and we can, uh, uh, we, you can try it for yourself and, and see, if it, see what, what gains you get from it. Matt, that's brilliant sort of telling us about all these systems. I think really key to it is if you're not sure you have any questions, get in contact with yourself. Absolutely, thank you.